Hunting, hunting, something, something. Gun equals fun. Sun equals run. Shoot deer. Down a beer. The leaves are near. History of mankind is clear. Gun stops fear. And promotes cheer. Hunting, hunting, hunting something, something, something. All right. That was an original ditty by Jay Myers. Thank you. And I'm Chris Kerr. And I wrote, Texas. I wrote that to start this episode off kind of with a more positive vibe. All right. This is a special hunting episode. Kind of tis the season. All right. I, I, I should have said hunting for freedom. Which? Hunting oh, colon hunting for freedom. Something like that. Is that how you want me to? I don't know. The we'll do title that. hunting colon okay. hunting for freedom. Let's start off by drawing the main character. I like that. That looks cool. You like that? That looks pretty good. All right, which is His? the hunter. I can't quite see what you're doing, but I love. I like this part of the episode, probably my favorite, where I'm just trying to kind of figure out what he's doing, and then it all comes together, and that really kind of I think is the magic of our show. Yeah. Well, like this right here, this is fascinating. See, I, okay, so it's a uh, it's a hunter's face with a yeah. hunting cap on. Yep. Because most hunter is just a mass of hair. They typically look like Hank Williams Jr. Um, you almost always have their Remington glasses iPad? on. Uh, yeah. Remington glasses. Yeah, it's like a keeps the glare out so they can see when they're pointing their gun. Maybe some camouflage and whatnot. Ear flap. Ear flap's a little bit high. You also did, and, this time I noticed you did really good with the um, angle of the nose. It looks a lot better than than before. Do you have a ruler? I don't need it actually. It's a pool stick. Nope. This is a... It's hunting for freedom in Remington the pool. Remington 30-06. Which is a pretty powerful gun. Sure is. I don't want to draw his whole arm, but I'm going to... You should probably... It's, yeah. it's behind there. I see it there, it's yeah. It's behind there. Okay. And he's hunting for freedom. When you hunt for freedom, you're usually by some kind of landform, rocky crag, mountain... Um, I like what you did here because it's, it's about perspective. And so this is kind of something that I love about most of the stuff you do. It always has some, like, a really unique perspective. And I'm not sure what I'm looking at until it kind of comes together like this. Well, thank you. I appreciate that. That was, like, the per you know, when we wrote the song to make it positive, And I kind of want to stay yeah, in that frame. Lots of spin on it. Okay. So, so what is this? Um, that is this a deer or a goat head, a uh, mountain goat. This is a bald eagle. Which symbolizes... Freedom. So he's hunting yeah. for freedom. Which, as an American, as a fellow American, with wearing a T-shirt with an eagle on it and wearing a Bocephus Hank Williams Jr. hat, also with a screaming eagle. Ah, I thought that, that was a phoenix. That I... I thought that was no, a phoenix. I'm pretty it's... sure it's a phoenix, actually. Oh, really? Seriously? Can you just say it's a bald eagle? Uh, All right. So, so bald now, eagles. the wingspan of an eagle can be up to six feet. Whoa. So they can get quite large. It's a very big bird. They have bald eagles at the uh, Willowbrook uh -huh. Wildlife Center. Is that like a little one? Yeah. Yep. This is baby freedom and another baby freedom. And That's cool. Eagle's going to feed it worms if um, it doesn't get killed. All right. I think I'm about ready to turn it over to you. Let's, can you draw a little bullet? Oh, yeah, sorry about that. I'm going to draw a big bullet. Because the 30 out 6 is no joke of a bullet. Yep. My friend Anthony actually and I would shoot softballs out of a pond on his property with a thirty out six. That's pretty cool. What's your favorite gun? My favorite gun would have to be probably the one of the guns I shot the most growing up, which is a BB gun. Oh, I saw a video of you on YouTube uh, shooting nine, nine mil millimeter. Yep, nine millimeter forty five. I've I've shot quite a bit of guns. Very I was raised video. in. Well, that's not that disturbing, but like, I was get raised. Some, get some. No, get I, some. I did not. <laughs> I was raised in Missouri. So we, this is a, like mm -hmm. a pretty normal thing. I never hunted myself, yeah, but well, I knew kids that did. Okay, well. It'd be better if you were from Kentucky, which I'm from Kentucky. I thought you were from Alabama. Um, I have a lot of family in Alabama, but I actually was born and raised in Kentucky. All right, I'm going to rattle off some other things people hunt for. Which, uh, deer? Nope. Squirrels? No nope. Bargains. Ooh, that, uh, that's funny. That's good. That was Name cool. something else people hunt for. They hunt for sometimes bear. Oh no, that's not on my list either. Knowledge. Well, and bear too. What's um something that you'll be hunting for if you don't get this animation done? I will be hunting for a 
job. Oh, <laughs> okay, well, you can't not, um, I mean, you, okay. That's, that's, all right. Okay, well. Treasure? Well, okay. Well. What's, um, <laughs> something else, Easter eggs? <laughs> and witches. Witch haunts are very popular in America. But illegal. They're not legal anymore. Nope. They... There you stop being legal in what year, yeah. Chris? 1646. That is actually right. 40, over 46 years ago. Which, 46 years is a long, long time. What are you doing there? I, I am... I've lost track of what you're doing with the uh, drawing. So what we're doing, we're Animate. animating the bullet because Animate in hunting, this. guns actually are projectile... Wait, they they project... Can I, can I they, interrupt? They, the last... They project, sorry. Uh, Jay misled us. The last la oh, last executions of people convicted as witches in Europe took place in the 18th century. Really? Witch hunts in America took place as late as 2002. No. Yep. I'm reading it right here. Wow. So, of course, a because... witch hunt is a search for witches or evidence of witchcraft, often involving moral panic, mass hysteria, and lynching. Because this is freedom, it symbolizes freedom, in real life, you can't shoot an eagle. It's illegal. Nope. It's true. What? It's true. Well, you can shoot them. You just can't tell anybody. It's illegal if you get caught. Oh, okay. Well, now you sound like my uncle. But Did you shoot your phone off? No. I'm sure we don't get any calls. Let's take a moment. Uh, uh, no, I, my mom didn't call me until right. 7, so it's fine. So we've got now... Street lights are coming. We're going to animate... So you can shoot an eagle... You can hunt an eagle. You can't hunt um, an eagle. You can kill an eagle. You just can't get caught. If you get caught, I don't you better, know. You we better pretend like you're what the heck is hunting for knowledge here? out there. Okay, this is not working. Okay, there we go. You got it. Yeah. No, uh, it's so really good. Yeah. What so um, the pre-Christian twelve tables of pagan Roman law has provisions against evil, incantations, and spells. Has any. Intended to damage cereal crops. What? Intended you can't to what? cereal in the field. Like Fruity Loops. Lucky Charms in the field. Guess how many <laughs> women were executed as witches in the context of an epidemic illness? Twelve. One hundred and seventy. Whoa. So now we've got the eagle is going to get revenge on the hunter because you Oh, so can't. it looks like Jesus stopped a lot of witch hunting. In one eighty four B.C., about two thousand people were executed for witchcraft. And then the oh, whoa, that's gonna, looking really cool. It's going to be awesome. Hold on here. It's so, in perspective. So about right getting, here is when... So you see what he's doing? That's a, it's a very common trick. Um, that animators where, do. As things get closer, they get bigger. It's perspective. Again, we've talked about this a little bit with Chris's work. That's one of my favorite things about Chris's stuff. Oh, thank you. So here we go. Check right. this out. Okay, so we've got the illegal hunting of an eagle. Whoa, hunting for freedom. Oh, wait, what happened? Whoa, uh-oh. Uh-oh. Bullet. Read some, more facts why, read some more facts while I fix Bullet. this. Bullet flew away. Preparing display video. Um, the Hebrew to. Bible condemns sorcery. Basically saying it's... Illegal. Oh, no, it's open season on witches. So what? it's like grab your guns and let's shoot these witches. Okay, I jacked this up, but here, let's see what happens. Yeah, you can try and fix that. Well, I think it, no, I think it'll work. Watch. So the bullet flies past the eagle. The eagle soars in. And the hunter appears. Whoa! So it's a little in reverse. Let me see if I can fix that. Hold on. All right. Damn it! Dang it! Let's see, modify. Dude, just. I'll show you. Settle down. Okay, well. Bro. You got okay. this. <sighs> okay. You got this. So change the speed. The decretum oh, of Burchard, comma speed. Bishop of Worms. Sirs. Okay. You hear me, Bishop of Worms. Uh, let me read you a fact that I have here. It okay. says, it's a, this is a fact, if you want to be for gun control, you join a list of some of the most famous dictators of the world, and that is a quote from William Just LaSalle. No, uh, William LaSalle, who is a YouTube user. No. Oh. Okay, so now let's check this out. I think this should be right. So bullet Whoa! flies. Whoa! Misses the eagle. Whoa! The eagle soars in. Whoa! And the hunter dies. So Nice. That was awesome. We did. Now I noticed. Yeah, we did three layers. So that's pretty cool. Right. You can hunt for freedom.
Perfection.